Well, it's a problem that impacts tens of thousands of people in two counties. This morning, ABC Action News anchor Lindsay Logue hits the road in Palm Harbor to find out what's tying up traffic and if there are plans to clear up your commute. Pasco's building boom is great for Pasco, but for drivers in Pinellas, it's turned into a traffic nightmare and it's only getting worse. Palm Harbor has a traffic problem that stretches for miles on East Lake Road. It's uh, very congested. Thousands of people drive this stretch every day and thousands more are coming. It's only going to get worse. That's because many people moving to Pasco and new developments off 54 work in Pinellas and there are only two ways to get there. This is a unique situation. We're bound by Brooker Creek Preserve on the east and Lake Tarpon on the west and it's a it's a funnel. By three o'clock on a Friday afternoon, East Lake Road is brake light city. City. Drivers are frustrated. But it was a little disappointing in our forum Monday night to hear that that really there's just nothing on the radar screen at the moment to be to, to address the traffic issue here. The county has done some things to help improve the drive, including longer turn lanes and flashing yellow left turn signals. But drivers say it's not enough. Some want more lanes. So now I think it's time for six. While others fear it'll turn into a super highway. You'd get some temporary relief for a while, but you'd end up getting longer traffic lights and more cars, and it'd just be like 19. If you drive East Lake, the Council of North County Neighborhoods wants to hear from you your suggestions and ideas on how to clear up congestion. You can find their email address on our website at abcactionnews.com.